Well, a new COVID variant is making its way across the country as health officials expect a surge in cases this fall and winter. Yeah, CBS 17's Dina Harley has what we're seeing here locally and how the flu is playing into it. A new COVID-19 variant floating around. I think the variants will continue to evolve. They become uh, becomes increased infectivity with a little more escape from natural immunity and from vaccines, which is why we see them. Called the XEC variant, over half of states have reported at least one case of it. The good news. There's nothing unique about any of those, really, in terms of the symptoms. That means current vaccines should give some protection against this new variant. The bad news. We've been seeing an increase over about eight weeks of this surge. Uh, with increased uh, cases, hospitalizations, deaths. That's certainly been true here at UNC Medical Center. The variant also comes at a time when health officials are expecting a surge in COVID, flu, and RSV cases as temperatures dip and people spend more time inside. People can get more than one infection at the same time or one of each infection sequentially, so of course your risk grows, goes up. Health officials we talked to say they're still looking into vaccine rates and numbers across the state after a new COVID vaccine came out a few weeks ago, but their advice is... The new vaccine is specifically recommended actually by CDC for everyone six months and above. Given the high numbers we're seeing, everybody should get the new vaccine. In Raleigh, Dina Harley, CBS 17 News.